Are you planning to put your property on the market and confused about the type of listing to choose? Worry not, as we delve into the various types of listings available, each with its unique set of benefits and drawbacks. Firstly, we have the open listing. This type grants the freedom to work with multiple agents or agencies, hence maximizing the property's exposure. However, the flip side is a lack of exclusive representation, which might lead to coordination issues and potential commission disputes. Next up is the exclusive right to sell listing. In this arrangement, a dedicated agent works tirelessly to sell your property, incentivized by the promise of a commission, irrespective of who brings the buyer. However, the catch here is a commitment to work exclusively with one agent, which might limit your flexibility. The exclusive agency listing is a balanced type. It offers the flexibility to sell the property independently without paying a commission, provided you find a buyer. But, if an agent brings a buyer, a commission must be paid, creating a potential conflict of interest. The Multiple Listing Service or MLS listing ensures maximum exposure by listing your property on a database accessible to numerous agents and potential buyers. The downside here is the need to pay a commission to both the listing and buyer's agent if both were involved in the sale. Pocket listing, also known as exclusive listing, is for those who value privacy. It allows you to control who knows about the sale of your property. The downside, however, is the limited exposure which might result in a longer time on the market and possibly a lower sale price. Coming soon. Listing is a great way to generate anticipation among potential buyers before the property hits the market. However, exposure is limited during the pre-market period, and transitioning to an active listing needs careful timing. An online-only listing could save you commissions by listing your property on online platforms or auction sites. However, exposure to traditional buyers is limited, and the burden of marketing and negotiations falls heavily on the seller. For sale by owner or FSBO, offers complete control over the process and savings on agent commissions. However, the responsibility of marketing, negotiating, and handling all aspects of the sale rests on your shoulders, which can be challenging and time-consuming. Lastly, an auction listing can lead to a quick sale and potentially a higher price due to its competitive nature. But there's no guaranteed sale, and if the reserve price isn't met, the property may remain unsold. Auctions can also be costly and stressful. In conclusion, when choosing a listing type, consider your goals, the local real estate market, and your desired level of involvement. Consultation with an experienced real estate agent can help make an informed decision based on your specific circumstances. Remember, the choice is all yours. If you need further assistance don't hesitate to reach out. Dial 862-371-6037. Here's to a successful property sale.